So here's how to delete your Wix account permanently. It's very easy to do, and maybe there was something you didn't like about it, or maybe you found a different solution. Regardless, I'm gonna show you how right now. First things first, you wanna make sure that you go to your website's main dashboard where you can see all of your websites. The reason I say this is because you wanna put them in the trash first. You're gonna to need to do that. So in order to do that, what you wanna do is hover over the three dots and simply do move to trash. For some odd reason, mine has been glitching where it shows up on the left side, but I'm gonna to go to move to trash. And I'm gonna do the same exact thing for the other one, of course, move to trash. And do move to trash. Like I said, mine's glitching, so yours should show up kind of in the middle there and you'll be good. Now that's the first step, let's move on to the last one, even though there's like a few steps in the last one. Click on your logo at the top right. And from here, what you wanna do is go to account settings. All right, and once you are here, what you wanna do is scroll all the way down to the bottom of the section. I just have a few private things that I wanted to keep private. That's why I have the notepad sections over that. But what you wanna do right here is simply click on close your account. And like it says right here, to close your account, first move any remaining sites to trash. If your site has any premium plans or domains connected, you'll need to cancel or transfer them first. So keep in mind, that's also something you need to do, but this is going to be just for like a free plan. If you have the extra premiums, you just have to do those as well. Let's move on to the last part, which is close your account clicking right here. All right, so here's gonna be the final step of this. So it says, tell us why you're closing your account. This is optional, so you can do this if you want, if it's up to you. This is also gonna be optional where you can give some feedback about anything else you'd like to share. And what you're gonna to need to do is to continue, enter your password, and then of course you have to check this off where it says, I understand that closing my account will remove all of my data. And once you are done and once you have your password in there, this will be highlighted where you can actually close your account. Click on that and you're gonna be good to go. I hope you got some value out of this video, and if you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up as it helps me out a lot. My name is James, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video.